Alright everyone, welcome back. This is where we ended up. Apparently shit went down. Cause uh MJ12 troopers are dead. Look out the window to the northeast. The building with the green beacon is the crew module. It should contain a lift that goes down to the manufacturing level. Careful, Chase. The Ocean Lab's electrical systems are waterlogged in this fire. Yeah, so shit went down. And there's also a dead guy in there. I, I don't even know how he managed that. He, he got into... They got... There's fucking like five of them. Holy shit. Alright, we gotta land the hell out of that. And there's apparently a human skull here. Even worse. Alright, well there's um... Some notes and stuff. Uh, let's have a look at the... Computer here. All right, we'll read the note a little bit better. Um, life support is operating in some areas, but our telecommunications links to the surface are literally dead in the water. Nobody's coming for us. Tell Marion HR I'm sorry. Okay. So, fail safe system. Uh, I'm getting I'm getting some System Shock 2 vibes right now. Let's uh, take the feature just with, with us, obviously. Yeah, let's not take that with us actually at all. I don't want that shit. All right. Let's have a look around. Well, there's a dead... Uh... Dead Karkian, for some reason. Alright, we got our Nano... Taro Lab... bio okay, alright. That worked out, I guess. Well, that's the key! Nothing over here, though, really. Except for dead scientists with bio cells. I uh, got fires all over the place. I don't know if I'll be able to put them all out. This is getting serious. Security locks have failed on the containment pens. Uh, yeah, so. Like I said, shit went down. Apparently he, he, he got his legs crushed by the door. Can I actually carry him? I can. Oh no, his legs are fine. Look at that. <laughs> I, I, <laughs> as I said, I know what they were going for. Alright, let's have a look here. Uh... I, mean, I can't just top in there. Ah, uh, there's another key here. I think it's to the same place though. Oh, we got one camera. We can just we can just go up again. To the command center. Security system compromise. This is seriously like the system shock two vibes I'm getting. Alright. Well, let's uh load up on this and uh walk on in. So that's Helios now, the merged AI. I I I, I like the curse's voice better, but yeah, it, that one's still pretty good. It's not hitting me, is it? Can't be. Yeah, I, I just turned it all off. I, just, I don't know what it was doing. Ah, uh, no. Open the door. Lead the way, Denton. <laughs> we could just throw a lamb at it, but who knows. Alright, I kind of hurts. Actually, let's uh, eat some health packs, actually. Oh, uh, yeah, that brings us to full health. Food's over here. Oh, soy food, obviously. And a couple... Oh, shit. I'm gonna say my first shot probably missed. Oh, wait, no, 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 I don't want to be here. Wow, oh, they actually hurt. They actually hurt a lot. Alright. 
Activate security bot. That seems really bad, actually. Oh. This guy. I guess if you want to stealth the Greasels, then sure, you can't do that. Can't find anything, can't find anything. Oh, medkit, good. Medkit to replace one of the ones we lost. Damn it. Oh, good thing I have a slight bit of delay ability. Alright, so we have a, uh, a door over here. We can also go this way. Who would have thought Greasels can swim? Biocell. Clearly there was a bit of flooding here. Just just a little bit. Hopefully I won't have to face off on against five Karkians, but you never know. That's not fair, you can fire your gun underwater. Should wait, what's up? What's on the other side here? Nothing. Why are all the Greasels alive? Get out of here. And now I can't see anything because of the, <laughs> the effect. Alright, here we go. Alright, uh... Actually, there's absolutely nothing in here. This is a Greasel holding pen. Alright, uh... Five, six... Fuck. I can't read it. Uh, one sec. I can, I can actually just take it with me, can't I? Or no, it says, uh... Big machinery... Tunnel code for you. Okay, so five, six, nine, zero. Oh, well, we can open this, too. Oh, uh, we can actually take this hazmat suit. Way better than candy bars. We are actually out in the water. Uh, do I have a rebreather still? I do not. I could have bought one, but yeah. I mean, that may have been useful for this area. I don't know how much I really want to be doing here, though. There's gotta be some reason I'd want to be out here, though. But I'm gonna get some oxygen, I'm gonna try it again. Alright, uh, let's take a biocell. Eat that, save, and let's go deep. Now, I imagine if you have, like, uh, some kind of fear of, uh, water, I, I imagine this is not exactly a great experience for you. Uh, seeing as we are very deep underwater and, um, swimming with no destination in mind, so I apologize in advance. Uh, yeah. Because that's the shit of nightmares. Alright, I, I don't see anything here, so we're gonna head back and get some more air. I, I imagine there is some purpose to being, uh, to allowing us to go here, so that's why I'm, uh, uh, doing this. Why is something trying to shoot me? <laughs> that's also a very pleasant noise, <laughs> as well. I just uh, we haven't looked around the crew module enough to be honest, but I, I I did like the fact that I upgraded all my uh augs for this, so you know, I figure I might as well. I've never actually explored here. But there is probably something, I just don't know what it is. Yeah, this leads us in there. I mean, no I wouldn't think I, I would always think that the hatch is at the bottom, so. Alright, let's uh Let's skip out on this then. Let's just go normally then. I I don't know what's out there. The five six nine zero I think was the code. That's some spooky shit though. As I said. Uh, let's see. Five. Whoops. I can't just undo it. Five six nine zero. All right, here we go. Uh, that's, uh, that's some guys.
Well, this has got to hell, it's all Ridley's fault. <laughs> I've been able to track him, but he's heading for the dock. Must have a URV scheduled to pick him up. No, I mean, let him, no way I'm letting him get away after what he's done. Grab some firepower. Uh, Excavation team is vanished sooner or later. Alright. What were they excavating for? That's the question. Where are you? Uh, we can just kind of head out that way. Is there like a... Sorry, I thought there was something else. We got skulls, crossbones... Fucking greasels, honestly. The fuck out. I don't even know I'm melaying them at this point. I had a. Uh, right, we go. Weapon modification reload. We're gonna smoke cigarettes, obviously. <laughs> All right, we got reload. Um, guess we'll put it on the shotgun. The shotgun has like no ammunition for it, and I think I wasn't able to upgrade the clip size. Otherwise, uh, why wouldn't I have done that? You know what? You know, what? I just uh, let's have some fun with flares. I, it keeps dropping them for me, so we'll just like we'll just use them everywhere. Yeah, like there we go. It's also a good defensible weapon, obviously. Okay, we can't see what's in there. Oh, that's shit. That's spooky. Wait, what the fuck? Why are you still alive? It gets spookier all the time. It's a baby Karkian. It ate the corpse of the other Karkian I killed. Okay, I think there's nothing else here. I can just add a flashlight to it, why not? Flashlight's the sucker's way, though. Alright, well, we have a... It wants three picks for that. I hate these things so much. There's another one still alive. Uh, is this where we came out of? No, this is somewhere completely different. Oh, shit. Alright, I think we found the mother. Yeah, it sounds like we need some sword combat. 80 skill points rewarded for the manliness, alright. And can use one health back there. Probably should... Get some more bio cells, but actually we have like tons of bio cells. We have bio cells for literal days. I'll just use one more just because I don't want to waste that. Okay. Can't drop that here. Drop it now. Alright, there we go. Weapon modification recoil on that thing again, yes. Until I max that guy out, I, I love recoil on that weapon. It's something I'm actually going to use now. Well, I've, I've used it for a while. I mean, we got we actually have some decent ammo for it now. Alright, so we got a key. I, I actually wasn't paying attention to what key we got. We could go in the logs file, but I just assume it's for the place to go forward and... Uh, there, there's really no other key it would have any reason to give us. Oh, excellent. We'll just keep that on. JC does not care about safety standards. I think he's kind of stuck. Alright, we got more tech goggles. Oh, more flares? We need those. How else will we be tactical? Okay, rebreather would be nice, actually. Uh, I don't know why I have fire extinguisher. We'll just get rid of that and bring one of those along. It would allow me to survive a lot longer underwater. If need be. Yeah, let's go over here. I gotta finagle my way out. Apparently apparently that's something I am able to do, but he is not. The other guy. Uh, well, we can go down there, or we can continue this way. 
No, uh, unlocked the, the this one. Yeah, so we saw this before. This is the guy that was just oh shit. Universal constructor. Well, you know, this may not entirely be a wonderful idea, guys. Oh, I have 11 rounds of this. I thought I could only have 10. Yeah, this may not be this my brightest moment to do in a place like uh, an underwater sea lab, but you know, underneath the ocean. Uh, we'll take the recoil mod and oh no, reload. Oh, we can't actually use it on the buckshot anymore, so I guess we'll just use it on this guy. <laughs> uh, I love that show, C Lab. Such a good show. Such a damn good show. Alright, can't open that. Put on radar transparency so he can't see me anymore. Probably don't need this thing anymore. Oh look, it opened this one for me. Look at that. Uh, well, we don't need we don't need a laser pistol anyways right now. Uh, whoever the hell finds this, I have an employee evaluation. Whoever actually reads those, three weeks down here and everything's gone to shit. Workplace is friendly and welcoming. Strongly disagree. Security systems try to kill me if I leave my quarters. I hope someone comes down here and tells me what the hell went wrong today. I right, that that may have been the guy. Uh, that we saw in the in the hallway before. That radar transparency is really coming in handy, I have to say. All right, let's uh, let's, uh equip this. So that one, that place is flooded. Uh, so I might actually try and go back there, because maybe there's something in there that's actually really worthwhile. Oh, sorry, I'm not trying to activate that guy. Maybe there's another way in, because obviously if it's flooded, because it's sealed right now, if it's flooded, that implies that I have the ability to grab something from there. Alright, we can, we can unlock this then. Kind of surprised we didn't find anything else. Well, it says just secure, but I just assume it, it's flooded, that's why it's closed. It, it was the one above the room, it's the one I couldn't interact with. Uh, oh shit, finally. Yeah, forget the tech goggles, we're using that. Oh, and thermal off the camera, that's also pretty good. Uh, what would we drop for that? Probably these stupid ass flares. Will you spin me right round, baby? Let's just get over here. Alright, see this one? This one right here. I can't even interact with it, so... It stands to reason that there's another room on the other side, but I didn't potentially look at it. So wait, what are we trying to do here? Uh, re uh, recover the schematic he needs to get a universal constructor. I, I thought it would be actually in there. Beyond that is a crew module. I'm going to double check that place, actually. As he says, he needs a... He needed something here, so... I kind of want to destroy this thing. Oh no, wait, universal construct. Okay, never mind. My bad. I, am, I almost went, like, completely in the wrong direction, actually. Be a sucker. I don't think I thought about it, because I'm like, there's no reason I should have been... That should have been a dead end. But I, I just didn't notice the elevator, actually. Oh no, we don't have flares. How horrible. Okay. We have plenty of... Time to save that shit. Alright. Let's have a look here. I hope you're the rescue team. I hope you came armed. Uh, really screwed us and whoever uh, wasn't drowned, eaten by one of those monstrosities. They've had us creating or cut in half by a turret has taken refuge in the UC lab. There's not many left. They've, I've jerry rigged some laser trip wires to warn us if any of our specimens make it this far looking for mommy and daddy. But now it's the spiders causing the problem. I don't know how much longer we can hold out. Please hurry. All right. We need some sabot shells. Directly with my 
my mind. I will be able to see anything, build anything, do anything. Just a little further, Denton. How does he keep knowing what I'm doing? He used to stop that. Alright, Universal Constructor. Alright, how do we get in here? Okay, well it's not so easy as sorting something. I wish it were that easy. Actually, this is probably a door. No, it's not. Well, did this guy have anything? No, he did not. Uh, well, there's a second floor here, but I can't access that in the slightest. We see a nice bot there. That would be nice to have right now. Am I supposed to lockpick that other ventilation shaft? Just sorry, I'm looking around. I, I'm, uh... Not entirely sure where it wants me to go. And with that confusion, uh, we will probably just go back to the ventilation shaft, I guess. I, can't, I actually can't tell where I'm supposed to go. I mean, two lockpicks for this shit, but you know. It's not abundantly clear to me where, where it wanted me to go, so we're going in here instead. I really want to talk to that bot, though. I need I need some more power. Ah, right, here we go. So now this brings us to the second floor. Maybe there's a key for the ventilation shaft or something. Because there has to be a way to always do things like a like like if you don't they assume like if you don't up, ever upgrade anything in this game that you're and you have no lockpicks and stuff like that. Let's say you know there's always a way to to get around everything. All right. Well, we can go down where the fan is. Maybe we'll just turn this off for a little bit. I want to get closer to the UC though. Sorry, I thought something was in the shadows. Uh, I have uh, I have the wrong uh, I have the wrong shells on right now. All right, I'll try and get as close as I can to the other side because maybe that has something to do with the. Uh, no, it's just all fans. Alright, fine, let's uh, see what the deal with the fan is. Okay. Apparently I actually can't even enter that, so I have to find one without a fan or that's broken or something. It's the only solution I can see. Maybe I destroy it? No? Oh. Well, what do you know? Violence is the answer. Okay, I wish I could see what I was doing, but I can't. And this just brings me back back down here. This doesn't actually lead ah. anywhere. It also hurts me. All right. It just kind of leads into this room again. I think that was the point. Uh, right. Oh, here. That really blended in with all this. It's, it could be a normal door. Alright, so there's just another way into the, uh, the building there. That's a really big button. Oh, actually, there was the bot somewhere here. I want to talk to the bot. Yeah, we don't need communications. Please, sir. Scramble grenade, that's gonna work out pretty well. Got some uh, energy. What? Oh shit. Okay, there's apparently a giant fucking spider. Uh, how do I go up? This is like, um, it's starting to use like these non-standard control interfaces, like I can't interact with doors directly. There's giant buttons on the side here. 
It's sort of confusing. The game has not done this until now. Alright, we got a bioelectric cell. This door doesn't open. Yeah, like it just is a control panel on the side here. Like that's it's it's like in a very odd odd location, some of these things, so I'm not expecting it right now. Alright, this is another uh Alright, well. Maybe maybe we'll just toss a EMP grenade in here. But you can hit me through the doors, it's not fair. I'm not using this that much shells. Fuck it, you know what? Oh my god. Okay, these things are impossible to sword. Why am I not using Sabot shells? Is the question that you guys all ask. Well, now we need to go get some more, uh, some energy. For absolutely no reason other than the fact that that probably wasn't handled in the best way. Uh, let's use the button. That's a really wonky button to press, let me just tell you that now. Or I'll just use my JC stealth walk powers. You can also go up here too. This one I this one I had to switch too. You gotta be kidding me. Like I said, there's like uh, I've never seen it <laughs> open up like that before. You actually can't blame me for that one. All right. Oh, there's a guy that's dead there. Oh, there's a glass here. That's very difficult to see. And if, yeah, there we go. I can't hit it. Is that a weird curve? What the fuck? Why are you still? Oh, he's disabled. Okay, it scared the shit out of me. Oh, there's TNT here. Alright, we got gas grenades. Uh, we got some viruses. That's pretty much it, actually. That's a very loud and noisy door. What does this guy have? Nothing. Alright. Now we gotta look for all the switches possible. Alright, so there's nothing here. They have laptops which I cannot hack. It's a leather chair. And we, have a, we have one control panel here. Yeah, whatever. You know what? It's just it only requires one, and I uh, look how much things I have. I have like seventeen multi tools. And we even get an, we even get another one. When we uh, get in here, so it's all good. Okay, right, so I, I I talk on an elevator, but I'm trying to see what's happening. Okay, that one down there. Huh. And that opens those, okay. I just feel the greasel in here. Oh no, okay, never mind. There's no greasel in here. What's this accuracy mod for? Okay, I'll just put on this sniper rifle. Uh, yeah, I guess we don't need anything else here, so we'll just go. Dude, those are those are interactable. Like you can just click on them, which is what, why it's, I find it so weird. Usually, it tells you it's like an infinitely locked thing, and then you look around a little bit more. Uh, yeah, it's gonna be kind of annoying. The bot there. All right, there's nothing here. I don't have any augmentations to do at the moment either. A shame. Uh, to get in the operations room, one, two, three, four. I don't know who set it up, but yes, it's the stupidest combination you've ever heard in your life. 
<laughs> uh, fucking hell, that door. It's a uh, Spaceballs reference, I guess. Well, not a fan of the doors here, but you know, what are you gonna do? Have a look at the Oh, well, there's a little bit to do in there. Have a look at security. Oh, there's nothing here. Oh, of course that wouldn't work. See, look, look, this one actually says locked infinitely. That's what I mean. I can actually press. I can actually hover on it. And it's just inconsistent. So now I know that the door actually can open. Oh, we'll just open this guy. Oh, there's assault shotguns, assault rifles. Silencer mod. I don't think I need that anymore, though. But, glad to know that there's a couple. Reload. There you go, that's a good one. Reload on that assault rifle, sure. The law here as well. Oh, you know what? Sure, why not? Security conditions five. Lockdown procedures are in effect. All personnel should report to secure locations immediately. Please wait for further instruction. Ballistic armor power supply used up. You know what? That's I don't want to do that. Yeah, let's just t put that away for now. Put on this. Go all the way to the other corner. Now bring out the law. It's a good way of dealing with him. I would love your energy. And there you go. He's been handled, and apparently this laptop must be like some fucking Apple or Toshiba to like premium shit in the future, because it did not give a fuck. Uh, it's like anti-law fucking laptops. It's even glass, too. Alright, let's go up and see what the hell is up here. Yes, Helios, yes. Uh, I got some radar. Oh shit! Just put on. Yeah, that that radar transparency is literally the best thing in this game. It's actually so good. We'll just uh, fire open this one and uh, activate bridge. Turn off the camera. All right. Oh, except the the turrets don't care about the. Oh, well, we know that, that they don't care about the... They, they don't care about whatever I do, but... It's okay. This is a different weapon of some sort. Uh, uh, nope, 1v1234. But we will try and open this guy. I just want to see what it is. No, it's just literally an assault shotgun. Okay. <laughs> Usually they have some kind of, like, uh... Super weapons behind this stuff, but yeah, not not today. What's at the end here? I wonder. Schematic should be stored on a computer in this room. Well, luckily we hack everything. Otherwise, I'd have to find that password for it. I would not like that. Access UAC. You see, uh, medics. Uh, thought I was getting a path. I was getting a. Did I not do it? Goals. Yeah. Yeah, I did it. Okay, we're just walking out then. I'm leaving a copy of the schematic in your data vault. It's exactly what we need. I'll catch a ride with Jock and meet you on top of the subbase's command module, just on shore. Alright, what's the schematic we got here? Oh, there you go. Well, 
Little elevator. There's a green guy in a chair. Let's just sit there. So now we just backtrack through, I guess. Alright guys, we're gonna leave it up here. I'll catch you guys next time. Goodbye.